Welcome to the Cat Cannabis Show. I'm Cat Cannabis, uh, co-author of Dreams That Can Save Your Life. And I have the other co-author on here with us tonight, Dr. Larry Burke. Hey, Larry. Hi, Cat. Uh, it's great to be with you. And we're just going to give a brief overview of what the book's about. So okay. uh, it really started uh, from uh, the dream research that I did back in 2015, where I surveyed 18 women from around the world who'd had dreams about their breast cancer, warning them before they had any symptoms. And of course, you were one of those women, so you might let people know uh, very briefly what you experienced. Well, mine was a little different from the rest of the dreamers who are in the book because I had breast cancer three times and the doctors missed it all three times, but my dreams told me I had it all three times. And by dreams, I'm talking about monks <laughs> that came into my dreams and told me that I had breast cancer and to go back to my doctor. So, you know, what was interesting, Larry, about my dreams when I was going through all the dreams in the book is that these spirit guides, these monks didn't say, oh, go find Swami Wami Ramalama Ding Dong because I had done it. They said, you go back to your doctors. And I did every single time. So and, we worked together. And, and it, that was really inspired me to, to, to uh, you know, really dig deeper into everyone else's story in the, in the project too. And, and, and you and uh, and Suzanne in, in the book interviewed everyone in detail. So we have all their stories uh, in the book just the way they happened with their, their actual uh, transcripts of their dreams and, and mm -hmm. their pathology and, and what they had, uh, what the dreams led them to discover. And then on top of that, we've got um, other stories about other types of cancers that are coming in once the uh, paper came out. And so we have dreams about brain tumors, lung cancer, colon cancer, skin cancer, uh, tongue cancer, you know, testicular cancer, ovarian cancer, uterine cancer, all kinds of different cancers, as well as dreams about other types of illnesses like uh, diabetes and things like that. Mm -hmm. That's true. So the, the book was not only um, about cancer. And, and then what, what really uh, made the book interesting was after I'd had you and, and uh, Dr. Bernie Siegel on a show together to talk about dreams because he was talking about dreams and, and paintings that his children did, his patients did. And you were talking about your dream research and he wanted to be in the book. So he wrote the foreword, which was an amazing foreword. Yeah. And the children's chapter. And we have a couple other dreams contributed by other doctors who had dreams about their own cancers. So we also mm -hmm. have dreams uh, about uh, healing that, that guided, beyond just the diagnosis, guided people through their healing process, through their chemo, through the radiation, and the choices they had to make. Uh, and we have a few other dreams about uh, people who had dreams about other people's cancers or other people's illnesses. So we mm -hmm. have quite a variety. And then you might want to mention about your, your chapters on techniques for remembering your dreams. Yes, we, we have a chapter on um, how to remember your dreams using uh, so dreams, S-O-D-R-E-A-M-S. And that will help you remember them because what, what good is it to have a great dream that can save your life if you don't remember it? And then the seven different types of dreams, we talk about that. And then you had some chapters, some educational chapters in the book as well, Larry. Yeah, talk, the book begins with an uh, introduction to sort of the history of, of dreams and healing from the ancient Greeks to Edgar Cayce to uh, Jung and Freud and, 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 the, and the shamanic traditions. So yeah, mm -hmm. that, and, and that's really what's inspiring us to want to wanna restore dreams to their rightful place in medicine. And that's one of the main visions for the, uh, for the book, as well as inspiring people to, all around the world to keep a dream diary and pay attention to it. Yes, because these dreams um, can not only save your life, they can save someone else's. We have dreamers in this book who had dreams that saved someone else's life. The dream was for them, which was really amazing because I've had people say to me, well, you know, the dream that you had was because somewhere in your mind, you connected with that cancer and that's why you had the dream. But these people were dreaming about somebody else. Exactly. So, so we'll let, let people know that they can... For more information about the book, they can visit my uh, website, which is LarryBurkeMD.com, uh, uh, or visit your website. KathleenO'KeefeCannabis.com, and go to our Facebook page, Dreams That Can Save Your Life. We have all kinds of information on there, plus the link to the book, 
which right now is at 23% off. Through and, Simon on, and, Schuster. and pre and you can pre-order through, through amazon.com as well. And the links are on the website. So thank you very much. Thanks guys. We'll see you next Tuesday until dream, then. Good night. Dream well. <laughs>